everyone, I realized I have not even vlogged yet. It is 11.06. Ash just left for work. Pete left ages ago. Um, I was sitting on the couch. It's so cold, this living room, because it's all open, it's so flipping cold. Sorry, my wires, hold on guys. I've got you all twisted, because I've got the phone on charge. Oh, just made it worse, hold on. <laughs> You're going for a ride. Um, because it's so open, it just, there's drafts everywhere. It's a very old house, and we definitely, I've mentioned this before, we need new windows. But sitting there, I can just feel it coming through the window. I even got a scarf on in the house. Uh, not a thick one, but just to have around my neck. I've been awake since five this morning. I do have to go to the yearbook meeting that I was hoping. <laughs> I'm so bad, I jinx myself. There was a two hour delay. I'm ho I was hoping to hear her and all after school activities have been canceled, but no such luck. Uh, Pete's left a list anyway. It's just going out there. I was out with the dogs before and getting the recyclable bins in. It's just bitter, bitter cold. And again, I know we're not as cold as a lot of you. And you just have to take it for our area, what we normally get compared to what everybody else normally gets. Um, I know everyone's like, oh, don't be, you know, stop moaning when people have it a lot worse. People are always going to have it worse, guys, always. And I feel very much for the ones of you that I definitely know are in these cold areas. It's not safe. It's not safe. Um... I'm going to make something to eat in a bit because I have a bit of a nagging headache, which is what woke me up at five o'clock this morning. Ash wasn't too chuffed about going to work either. It's just, she, I don't want to go outside. Um, but she started her car early enough. So it should be warm, which I'll be doing too before I go to the meeting. But um, I finished the job I had to do, got it all sent off to the lab. Bing, bang, bosh, done. And um, that's it for now. So I'm going to finish editing my vlog. I don't know what to have to eat. I want something a bit substantial because it is cold. I'm wondering, maybe I'll make a jacket potato. Because that's filling and it'll be hot. And that. Because I'm kind of... I got my delivery of English bacon yesterday, but I don't really fancy bacon today. I just said to Ash, I wish I had a chef. Can you please make me some uh, avocado toast or an omelette? One day. <laughs> Not in my lifetime, but one day. It was really cute. Ashley follows this girl on Instagram, and she started following Ashley first. And she has quite a few followers, and she's a makeup... I, I think she's a makeup artist, or she's a, a makeup artist influence I'm not really sure but um, one of the companies was asking if anybody had any recommendations or anybody they should add to their PR list and this girl put Ashley's page and Ashley's information which I thought was really cool of her so made Ashley's night anyway she goes nothing will come of it it doesn't for me but she said it was so nice that she thought enough of my work to put me forward Anyway, I better get on with editing, um, and I'll talk to you Hello guys. Everybody, ooh, it's cold. It's uh, it's warming up though. It's much warmer than it was this morning, believe it or not. But uh, it's just that bitterness. I had to clean up some stuff, so I don't know where I put my gloves. I think they're back in my pocket. They're back in my pocket. Um, I'm gonna head over to the school see if I can get a parking spot. It's two fifteen. Um, yearbook's not for another half an hour, but. Sometimes it takes me 20 minutes to get a parking spot. So I'm gonna go try now, see how well I do. And I'll talk to you guys after. Because I'm early, 2.22. I got a spot right out front. The only spot. So, yep, I'm here. I'll go in, I guess, and get started on my own. Hello everyone, yes, look at the red face again. I just came out of the computer room or the internet cafe, sorry, there's a computer room upstairs and the internet cafe where we hold our yearbook meetings. I only had half my crew today, but I have to tell you, got everything done, so it was good. Brilliant job, everyone. 
gawking over her red. Oh, and my hands are cold because I just took you outside, didn't I? Took you outside and Louis's still out there, isn't he? Huh? Oh, you're so happy I'm home. You're so happy. I'm happy too. Um, kettle's on and slippers are on. I've realised I put my shoes on first thing this morning. I never, I just kept my shoes on, never put slippers on at all today. Because I knew, excuse me, that being and out with the pups and what have you and the slippers on the ice and the snow, even though it's not too bad out there. But the thing is, the roads outside on the street are white because they put so much salt and stuff down yesterday that you can't even see the pavement now. It's just all white. So when I first pulled out, I'm like, is this snow? No, it's not. Cowboiled rocks, can you go make my tea? She's like, no, so I'm going to eat my biscuit. Because then when Louis comes in, I'm going to want another one. Yeah, next week, I know for sure that Pete will be at the yearbook meeting with me because we have the groups and organisations. And I just got the list from the principal. They start... What do time do they start? They start at... First one comes in at 8.40, but Pete and I have to get all the equipment up into the library and set up. So I think Pete and I get there by 7.30, if I remember right, from last year. And we have... <sighs> 39 groups, and he did say this is a draft. We might get some more. I actually know of one already because the guy emailed us and said, we're not on the list, but we don't do the list. Um, the school does the list and we just know we're there all day and we get the list from them and then we know who's coming through at what time. And there's a group comes through every five minutes, sometimes 10, but sometimes just five. So 39 But to be fair, some don't show up. <laughs> I'm just looking at these names, see if there's anyone different than last year. Do, 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 all the cat. And we're on here too, obviously, because we're a group and organization. Our picture's at 9.10. Usually ours is at the end of the day, but we're at 10 past nine. And I take the picture. I will, I'm never in it. I, do, I won't go in it. And he's like, get in the picture. I'm like, no. Okay, but can I say it again? I say it every time we have a meeting. I love my crew. I love my crew. They are so cool. I'll leave that for Pete to have a look at. Yeah. Cars everywhere. All right, guys. Gonna make that cup of tea and see if I can get Louis inside. Forgive me for laying back and being lazy, but my back is ee ee ee. And see, you know that cut, that cut there that you can see has been bleeding. I caught it on the corner of the of a knife and it just went right in and uh, and that one that stings so bad that one looks bad it's from one end of the nail and i can feel my heart beating it <laughs> it's throbbing Ugh. anyway um i just watched a live book no that's not even a word oh live books was used to be our uh invoicing system uh, no that wasn't even that it was quickbooks shut up sue I just watched a Facebook Live, even though it was recorded a few hours ago, I was just able to to watch it now, all about Taste Be Simple. And guess what? We get to find out on February 11th what the new line is for the spring summer. Usually we don't find out till March. I'm beside myself. I am. <laughs> don't I look it? Like I'm really beside myself. Woohoo! I'm doing a dance on the inside. You all know my favorite time of year with Taste Free Simple is when they switch, they have two unveilings of the new products and it's spring, summer, and then obviously fall, winter. By the time fall, winter comes around, I'm ready for it. By the time spring, summer comes around, I'm ready for it. I love to see what new items they have and they'll be available for us to buy on the 11th, which is really exciting. I'm actually gonna put it in my planner um, there's a, they're all going to Florida next week. One of these years, I really would love to go, but I need somebody, to, I need to sign somebody up on my team that would want to go so we could go together and have fun. But it's the 
um, what's it called? It's right on here. Oh dear. Oh, it's not on there. Lead, not lead strong. Oh, they just said it anyway. There's um, it's a they have two big meetings a year, conferences where you can go and they give you all the updates and all the new stuff and what's coming out and all the different incentives for hosts and all the different incentives for clients and consultants. It's exciting, but I always love the change of product time. It's not the change because we have a seasonal line and then you can still buy some of the winter stuff until it runs out, but uh, the standard line is always there. But I love... Um, what they're doing this year the consultant box that we can buy is all going to be all the new products whereas in the past it's been a, been a mixture of old products uh, standard products and the new stuff this time it's going to be all new 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 there's always about three things that aren't for me but um, they're always for somebody so I'm really looking forward to it it's still quite bright for what is it five o'clock on the dot I don't know if you can, yeah, you can see out there. I would go get a picture of the sunset. Everybody waits for it. I was actually asked yesterday, Suki, go get a picture of the sunset for me. But guys, my bag doesn't want to go anywhere. I had a cup of coffee. I was going to make tea, but I decided to have coffee. And I'm just chilling with my Roxy, catching up on some Facebook stuff and playing a game at the same time in the hopes that these spasms go away before the rest of the crew come home. Ashley's on till six. Peter will be getting off any minute and coming home. In fact, he's been leaving late the last few days, except yesterday they let him leave early. But um, he's been leaving about 20 past 5, 5.30. And uh, I'm going to see if he needs me to go tomorrow. He may not. It depends how many kids there are. But uh, if I feel like this, I don't want to go. But I feel bad saying that to him. But he used to do the, the daycare by himself because it is so few kids, but I didn't go last year because I was actually sick with a cold. And I thought being around three and four year olds is not a good idea, passing on the germs to them. And then the year before I did go, and the year before that I went, but before that he used to do it on his own. I never went with him, but yeah, we'll see, see what he says. But anyway, I will talk to you guys. I've always wanted one of these skins for my computer and I found them on Instagram is called Unique. Oh, right here. Unique Find. There, Unique Find. And I saw it and I'm like, should I, shouldn't I, should I, shouldn't I? They had a really pretty rose gold one, but of course my computer is silver, so that would have just looked stupid. But I couldn't resist when I saw it. I mean, look how flashy it is. You all know. <laughs> Who loves a bit of sparkle? Anyway, unique find if you want one. Um, you just give them the size of your laptop, uh, if it's retina, retina free, whatever, and um, they cut them to size and it fits perfectly. I left it for Pete to put on for me because I'm absolutely useless and I would have broken it or put it on squift. Um, Pete said it's really good material, it's really thick, um, so it doesn't bend a lot. It's not like a thin piece of paper, it's a pretty we can't really see, but it's a pretty thick piece. There you go, you see a bit better. But yeah, very cute. All right, so Ash went into the shower, um, washed her hair, she didn't want to go to bed with wet hair, so she's now watching something on her room. It's really loud. Pete's gone back into his office to scan some more of the baby pictures for the yearbook. So I've come up here to watch some stuff. Now my back is really playing up, so I may not be going tomorrow, we'll see. Pete said he didn't need me really. It's, I think it's only like 13 or 14 kids. It's not a, t a, you know, a load load, but we'll see. We'll see how it feels in the morning. So anyway, for now I'm gonna love and leave you guys. I hope you've all had a brilliant, brilliant Thursday. Whatever you guys did today, I hope it was a good one and we will definitely see you tomorrow. Good night.